those beautiful peeps welcome everybody to freaking apply my name is Dinesh and we are watching back again South Park the episode 7 or 14 it's called crippled summer and uh, we'll see a lot of Timmy I suppose in this one I mean who else is crippled in South Park other than Timmy oh Jimmy oh is it another Jimmy and Timmy episode the last one we saw was Jimmy versus Timmy or something like that Timmy versus Jimmy and they had the crippled team the blue and the reds I didn't know anything about it you guys told me about the blue and the reds or whatever and uh, let's see if they're gonna continue with that are they gonna join another gang or are they gonna fight with each other let's find out if you're not subscribed please hit subscribe and if you want to watch the full and reaction video this episode other movies and TV shows that I do and also if you want to watch the uncensored version of episode 200 and 201 head down to my patreon it's a one way to support the channel you get uncensored uncut versions over there and now without any further ado let's jump right into this one we're gonna start this in three two one viewer discretion is advised thank you Tali is back the towel the drug addict of course yes we know i, I mean he's not a drug addict it's weed addict i mean it is a drug don't mind about hey addiction. You, you going swimming? Don't forget to bring a towel. <laughs> he does not know how it's his information. Oh my god, what happened to the towel? Why are you burned like that? My god, what has fame done to him? Or what has drugs done to him? My name is Towel. Oh, he's okay now. T O W E. Towel. Why? E. Why? Never mind. <laughs> I'm great at cleaning up spills. All right. Well, you're just humping. And I'm 100% machine washable. I'm just an ordinary towel in a lot of ways. An uh, ordinary towel who talks and smoke weed. Did the marijuana mm -hmm. and crystal meth. Okay. We never and knew about crystal. Okay. We never knew about crystal meth and crack. Okay. Towelie, what have you done? <laughs> Nine years ago, Towelie started smoking marijuana. Two years later, he started experimenting with crystal meth. Okay, I don't, I don't Anybody want believe that. Suck? Okay. <laughs> Tally, no. Time. No. Tally it would suck. be actually nice though. Getting your dick sucked by a towel and you can just clean it up afterwards. And it's wonderful actually. But I want to come to the point that people say when you smoke marijuana, you, you that's like that gateway drug to other drugs. Hell no. Hell no. I remember being super depressed back in 2015 that I... Now, this is all out there, guys, and uh, I'm being honest, totally honest with you guys, and I literally said to a guy uh, who used to work in my office, because you look at his face, you're like, yeah, he does drug, and I told him to get me some pills. Those are the same pills that people who are addicted to cocaine take so that they can you know, reduce their dose, and I just want to thank God or any other power out there who never let that happen, who never let that guy bring that to me. <clears throat> and uh, a few weeks later after that, I tried marijuana for the first time. And, I, and after that, I was like, you know what? I don't want to go for any other drug. I don't smoke marijuana now. But in those times, when I was super depressed, I was like, I don't want to do any other drug at all. I don't even feel like, no, I, cocaine might be too much. And later I learned about all the, you know, the chemical drugs are a shit. Okay, guys? If you want to do drugs, do marijuana, at least it's uh, not a chemical. That's all I'm saying. And uh, if you are underage, don't do it at all. Okay? Description over here, I'm not telling you kids to do drugs. I'm just telling the adults over here who thinks that other hard drugs are good, cocaine, meth and crack, fuck no. If you want to do drugs, marijuana is, marijuana is fine. You become super chill and... Uh, it's even better than alcohol, I would say. And you just enjoy life. I just don't want to watch him kill himself. Oh. <sighs> I don't even know who he is anymore. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Butter is like a really caring person. Holly help. Our entire summer is going to be ruined. Stone dead. Oh, he will be. Are you ready for the summer? Cam for the handicapped. All right. Ready for the sunshine. Are you ready for the pleasure? Let's go, Jimmy! Look at Jimmy! It's our favorite time of year. Jimmy! Look at Timmy with the shirt! <laughs> the V-shirt! Hi, Jimmy! Hi, Tim! Jimmy! Wow, look at Lenore, everyone! Good Who job. is this Looney Tunes looking ass? This guy! Where's the towel? 
The towel Tau isn't here. I think it's off getting high again. <laughs> <laughs> for the past week, Tauli has been working in a summer camp for handicapped children. He has been given warnings for getting high 14 times. Oh my god. Oh my god. We got wet campers down there. Move your ass. When Tauli is doing heroin, he doesn't care about anything. Oh my god. Look at it. Are those cum stains on him? Those are cum stains on him, guys. Yeah, somebody was okay with the towel blowjob. We are ready for the big camp competition. Oh, we're ready, all right. Who are these Looney Tunes characters? <laughs> no way, Red Team can beat us. No way. <laughs> Red Team won't know what hit them. All oh, right, everyone together. Are we gonna beat Red Team this year? Yeah! 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 All right. Who are the Red Team? Oh, this guy. I think we have seen him before. Ah, uh, you always hated Jimmy, boss. Ever since he whooped you at soy friend last summer camp, he really took it to your good, huh? <laughs> Shut up, Mindy. <laughs> oh, sorry, wait, wait. <laughs> Shut up, Mindy. He's the kid with the guitar, isn't he? Like, oh, guitar, your competition. I didn't know he was handicapped. There's no way that blue team is gonna beat red team this year at camp. You got that? There's not the blue one, right? Blue team has been beaten at the past summer. Like, like, Legged race. The three legged races, blue team best to win. What we need to do, Menzi. When do you mean three legged? Are they talking about they're not talking about the penises, are they? Oh boy, we're gonna ruin blue team's chances, huh? We're gonna break their legs or something, boss? <laughs> the legs are yeah, already Jimmy. broken! Just do what I say, and we can make sure Jimmy Vama gets what's coming to him. Jimmy's legs are already broken. Better now? Yes, thanks. That's right. When you go Where swimming, did he come don't over? forget to bring up my dick. <laughs> Who hired that towel? You can barely walk, let alone dry somebody off. You think you're better than me? <laughs> <laughs> you think you're fucking hot shit? <coughs> A lot of times when Tally shoots heroin, he's <coughs> angry at everybody. You can all suck it. <laughs> you're all... Well, Tally, it looks like you have sucked dead before. Look at the cum stains on you. Tally was pretty happy before. He had a girlfriend he liked. Did he? Oh, shit, all right. And then she got pregnant oh, no. and had a little washcloth. All right, nice. What happened to the washcloth? Fuck you. Let me talk to him. Let me talk to him, you bitch. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> Tally said she talked to his son. <laughs> it's ex-wife and daughter. My son talked to Tally and he's I. I mean, I don't blame her. Our first event is the big canoe race. Ooh, right. Oh, boy, the canoe race is... <laughs> We gotta be, 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 we gotta Let's go! Why does that kid have a mustache and a grey one? <laughs> Look at the smirk on his face. Oh no! They put the black mamba in their own! Sir, you said to put the black mamba in the canoe, boss! Not in your own canoe! Okay, in your own canoe. The odds of the red team winning canoe is at a one to nineteen. Maybe they're like... Paddle faster, mate. No, no, they're not. No, no, they lost it now. Hey, hey, we need a towel. Uh, oh, uh, uh, just a sec. Not just a sec. <laughs> Why do you only have one towel, What's though? Going on? Oh my god, oh my god. How do you make somebody with drugs offering oral sex to older men? Of course he does. That's why. Okay. <laughs> you owe me money, asshole. <sighs> That's it. We're done. You are no longer employed here. Please, sir. We need a nice, clean towel here at summer camp. Uh, you, you, we don't yeah. need a towel that shoots heroin and has sex for money. And it's cum stain all over him. People are so picky about their towels. Of course they are. They're kids here, Towelie. They're kids here. You don't want to wipe the kids with that on your on yourself. We're going to get Jimmy killed by Native American. How? Here, take this. It's a fake scavenger hunt map. Why don't you do it yourself, Mimsy? It's gonna fuck you up. All right, Mimsy. Now you take this map to the Indian Reservation, and you switch it with Blue Team's map. You got that, Mims? You switch the map. Switch the map. Yeah. I got it, boss. Switch, switch the map. Switch the map. On. Just do it yourself. Don't give it to Mimsy. Mimsy is Dulali in every way. This yeah. doesn't make sense. There we go. Why would they make us go this far? We're handicapped. <laughs> at the... Wait. Yep. Wait a minute. What, what the... Yep. There you go. Keep oh, out. Oh, fuck. 
Mimsy, this is the map to the Indian reservation. Well, sure it is, boys. I told you to switch this with the map for Blue Team. No, you Just told me to it. switch the map. Switch the map. Yeah, so you I did. switched it and I switched it. Mimsy! <laughs> okay, uh, Mimsy is uh, uh, autistic, I think. <laughs> uh, I remember somebody telling me the story. With uh, with autistic people, you get to know, like, they are very smart in, like, one thing. Like, if they are, like, really good in maths, they'll be, like, fucking good in maths. You will tell them to do any calculation, they'll do it for you. Or they could be, like, good in English, or they could be good in uh, drawing, or uh, so many different things. And uh, but I remember this. But uh, my friend telling me the story that he asked his neighbor, uh, who is his godson, uh, he asked him to get some blue milk. And so blue milk means like there's milk which I think blue milk was like low fat milk, and the green milk is like fat milk. It's one or the other, uh, full fat milk. So he asked the he asked the kid to bring blue milk, and the kid came back with nothing. He said, "Sorry, I couldn't find any blue milk." And then he said, what do you mean? They must have milk. He said, oh yeah, they had milk, but they didn't have any blue colored milk. So like you have to tell that person exactly. You have to, like if you were to tell him, get the milk, which has a blue label or with the blue cap, he would have gotten it. But if you called that him to like, get the blue milk, he would literally look for the blue milk. So yeah. So I think that's what Memzi is about. My name is Nathan. I'm disabled. I don't give a fuck. They they make you more disabled. <laughs> hey everybody, let's all go to the office supplies. Who are you? Who, who's following you, Tali? Oh, there's a cameraman following. Computer duster. <laughs> Tali has run out of money for hard drugs. Now he inhales computer duster to get high. Of course he does. <laughs> I have one dusty computer. Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, know. Tali. You don't have to be an asshole. <laughs> Could conquer the world. Like after a level of high, you will you can't be high, right? Two hundred cans of computer distance. And after like you are immune to that much of high, you're like you won't get high that much ever again. Here, take this. Mm, what the it's fuck? a shark mating whistle. Uh, okay, boys, a shark mating whistle. We're gonna hit him over the head with it, huh, boys? No, you moron. <laughs> you go under. You the know what? It would be much better if you ask him to hit him with that. Yeah. He would actually do that. Shark is the deadliest freshwater shark in Colorado. Shark mating whistle can attack the sh attract the shake from our okay. Boys enjoying the fun beach. <laughs> yes, Counselor Steve. The beach is warm. Gee, that was a close one, huh, boss? They almost heard me saying we was gonna kill Jimmy. Okay. <laughs> Shut up, Mimsy. <laughs> Just I like the way he, he says it there. Mimsy. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, Timmy. Those waves are pretty big. I don't know which Jimmy. Disney character is that. <laughs> don't worry, Jimmy can handle himself. So do they mean like all Disney characters are handicapped? Do they mean by like do they mean that? I got me a shock whistle. Yeah, we know. Is she gonna bite your legs? Oh boy, here it comes. Here it comes. Here it comes. Let's go, Jimmy. Stand up. Oh no, Jimmy! What? Look, he's doing it. Let's go! Let's go, Jimmy! Fuck yeah! Hell yeah! Jimmy is floating. How he stood without this, you know, crutches touching. The, you know what? Fuck it, Jimmy. I'm going to find logic in this. Well, well, oh boy, Mimsy, you didn't do what I told you. Now, what do you mean, boys? You said to swim in the water and to blow the whistle. I swam in the water, so now I'm gonna blow the whistle. <sighs> Well, the, uh, still under the water, right? Fundamental. Yeah, of course. Yeah, it's Mimsy. You, you have to be literal, literally literal with Mimsy. You don't blow a shark mating whistle on dry land. You are supposed to blow it. Oh my God! Oh my! Oh my God! <laughs> oh my God! Nine inches long. He isn't nine inches long himself. Oh my God! Oh my God! Getting. Shagged by a shark. Is intervention. Oh my yeah. god! Imagine, <laughs> imagine telling people how, like you die, you go in heaven, and have people in heaven like, oh, so how did you die? Yeah, I got fucked by a shark nine inches cock on the land. All just being talking, Tally, and, and what I'm hearing is a bunch of people here who just love the heck out of you. <laughs> and they're yeah, they do. They, they care about you, Tally. You Look, we're done. Okay. They care about you. To, so you could get a job for your intervention. Kyle. <sighs> Tally. 
Over the past few months, I have watched you go from an ancillary character with a few amusing catchphrases to a dried out spoo drag covered in the jizz of a thousand spoo older drag. men. I know. Can we just end this, please? <laughs> Lou are still covered in the jizz, Tawali. If you do not accept treatment, I will no longer give you money or be your friend. I will not help you kill yourself. All right, Eric, do you want to go next? Cal, I hate you so much. You are a liar and a swindler who would do anything for money. And We're I hear for you, <laughs> I'm supposed to be allowed to finish. <laughs> he just wanted to say about Jews. Yeah, of course. <laughs> about the Jews. You are a race of beady-eyed thieves who always want... This is serious, you fucking asshole! I'm being serious, Kyle! <laughs> Hello? Kyle, we have to let people be allowed to finish during intervention. <laughs> He's talking about Jews. Television to rant about! Kyle, please! It is not your turn. Okay. Let's hear more about the Jews. You are a race of beady-eyed thieves, Kyle, who throughout the millennia have squirmed and worked your way into the dark cubby holes of society. Thank you. Where exactly did the Jews first get their power, and how are they able to manipulate our minds today? Oh my God! I thought you were talking about Tali now. <laughs> Talent show. All right, TV and TV can dance. Excuse me. How is everybody so chill? A kid got fucked by a shark today. Oh my god, where did he get the C4? A little wiggle out of Sunday. I'm gonna try to make the tardy cock a tally. That's nice actually. I'm dreaming of her. My tardy cock a hooligan. Oh, there's the solo. Oh, sorry, that's not right. Hang on. Shut up, Mimsy. <laughs> I love you, Mimsy. Shut up, Mimsy. Oh my God! How many papers? And where did he get all the papers from? From his asshole? Fuck no! Come I'm on, Tali. They want to help you. Play. This is bullshit. Don't give me fucking ultimatums. I thought you were my fucking friend. They are. That's why they're helping you. We are the only ones in this intervention yeah. who've been hurt by you. Oh. Who are you talking about? <laughs> Oh, Wash he brought his kid. You brought washcloth. Oh, that's low. Out on the beach with my dear little peach, where the waves are rolling in so high. Holding her hand, and damn it. Did you escape the ukulele? So I moved to the second verse of it. They set back Nathan plans immensely. Nathan, get up there and demand Nathan the ukulele. Nathan plans are solo. shit. It's our only chance. Yeah, okay, bud. If you get in a pinch, go through with the cinch. The ukulele solo. We want the ukulele solo. Sorry, Mims. I, I just can't remember it. Well, we want you to play it, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> maybe you can show me how it's done. Oh, okay. It's it real easy. You can play like this. Mimsy! <laughs> Mimsy! <laughs> you are the biggest idiot I have ever met. And from now on, if I want to do something, I'm going to do it myself. There we go. Come on. Now who's stupid? Ah! Ah. Yeah, he hit the B flat himself, causing his flat literally backfire on him. Literally. Okay, that's Black Mom. Oh my god! Okay, okay. He is dying today. He's dying. Oh my god. <laughs> Got blown off, stabbed, get stung by a snake, and then fucked by a shark. What a wonderful way to go! I don't want to hurt washcloth anymore! Oh. He's going, everybody! Come on! Let's go! Oh. <laughs> Even the old man is crying. I don't think he'll survive with the black mom. Oh, wet team. Now, Captain, where we got wet? <laughs> I never seen a kid get screwed by a shark. <laughs> I know, right? Me neither. I never thought of it. Say it again. <laughs> <laughs> Nathan, your team put up an amazing fight. Oh, look at Even the, though I was crowned king of Cripple Camp. Look at the crown king of Cripple Camp. Champ. Oh. I hate you, Jimmy. I fucking hate you with everything in my entire being. Uh, nah, you sure got stuck it through your this year, boss. Shut up. Miss Amy. Lindsay. Going to Ocean is okay. California. Towley is definitely one of the most addicted towels we've ever seen here. There have been more towels than him before? The most psychologically damaged towel I've Who's come across the first one? treating Kirstie Alley's towel, which had seen some, ooh, 
some nasty stuff. I don't know what- Hold on a second. Hold on a second. What's wrong with her? She looks alright. Uh, not in that picture. Oh, she died too. Okay. Tal, which had seen some, mm, some nasty stuff. Why? Why is she some nasty stuff? Can you guys let me know in the comments? Bring, but I'm learning to love what I am. It looks all better already. Let's go, California. Nice. Well done, Tal. people so that was the crippled summer poor poor mimsy mimsy is a nice kid okay mimsy is wonderful he's fun to hang around with he's always cheerful i mean he gets cheerful because he wants to kill jimmy but i don't think he really wants to kill jimmy i think he just wants to be with you know the little kid i forgot what his name was who always goes mimsy that kid poor Tauli, the days he has seen he started sucking off old men i mean i think if a towel would be living that's a wonderful thing to get sucked by because you can just clean yourself with it afterwards that's why the old people liked it oh boy things you do for drugs again i don't think no this is my own opinion but i don't think marijuana is a gateway drug of what i, I happened to me i actually stopped me uh, for never even trying the hard drugs and uh, I'm, I'm fine. I'm actually better. Thank God that never happened. And what's up with all the Looney Tune characters? So they, do they mean like all the Looney Tune characters are crippled? <laughs> Is that what the South Park mean over here? And uh, finally, where did Cartman get all the pages from? He's getting it from his back. I mean, he is he has a big tummy. Most of all, he has a big asshole. So he's probably having some papers in there. He learned everything well. He said everything about the Jewish people and what he wanted to say. And that's what he was there for. Or for Tauli intervention, just to let his hate out of uh, himself for Jewish people. That's Cartman for you. But yeah, guys, if you're suffering from any sort of drug addiction, please seek help. Uh, please seek intervention. The, the people who love you will be there for you always. Like people who love Tauli. doesn't matter how abusive Tauli was to them. They were there to take care of him because they loved him. So the people who will love you will be there for you. You just have to put an effort from yourself that you have to be better for them because they, they are taking care of you you have to take care of them by just being yourself better yeah that was it for today guys hope you enjoyed this reaction if you did please do leave a like comment subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and if you want to watch the full length reaction video you can watch it on patreon that's been it have a wonderful day see you tomorrow